My LDL cholesterol is 382, and here's why I don't care about it. I've been on the carnivore diet now for four months, and in that four months, my LDL cholesterol has gone sky high. And guess what my doctor would like me to start taking? That's right, my doctor wants me to start taking statins. Because we need to control that crazy high LDL, right? Well, no, not really. In this video, I'm going to talk about my LDL, why it's 382, and why I don't plan to do anything about it. So most people will usually call LDL the bad cholesterol, but it's not bad, depending on what you eat. Now, I should say at this point, I'm not a doctor, so I'm not going to explain this very well. But if you want a really good explanation about this, all you need to do is go to YouTube and plug in Dr. Paul Mason cholesterol, and you'll get quite a few videos that are going to explain to you exactly why LDL is not bad. Anyway, the reason that LDL gets a bad rap is because when people have cardiovascular disease, often they have elevated levels of LDL. The thing is though, LDL has a reparative function. So it's a little bit like saying all fires are caused by firefighters because when there's a fire, there are firefighters there. Or all serious injuries are caused by paramedics because when there's a serious injury, there tends to be a paramedic or two in attendance. So now I've got for you Exhibit A and Exhibit B. Exhibit A, here's me with an LDL of 382, weighing less than 150 pounds. Exhibit B, here's me a year ago with an LDL of 117, weighing almost 180 pounds. But doctors want us to take statins, eat whole grains, and eat more fruits and veggies. Seems like BS to me. Guys, if you like this short video, you're interested in doing carnivore, or you are doing carnivore, do me a huge favor, smash the like button under this video. Consider clicking subscribe and hit the bell so that you get notifications. And I'm looking forward to seeing you in the next video. Cheers.